Kigali's markets were packed on Sunday with people saying they are stocking up just in case the markets close in the near future, but also said there have been incidents of produce like rice and tomatoes increasing in price by between 100 and 700 rwandan francs. As for things like gloves and hand sanitizers, pharmacies are now asking for as much as 5,000 and 11,000 rwandan francs respectively, and yet the gloves were apparently being provided free before the first case of COVID-19 coronavirus was reported here in Rwanda. Retailers say the reason for the increases is due to higher wholesale prices and demand. Pharmacy owners say the sheer demand for sanitation items has led to scarcity, resulting in some hiking prices. Officials in the Ministry of Trade and Industry have called on people to stop panicking because no markets will be closed and warned retailers against hiking up prices to take advantage of the situation. Hiking up prices is not allowed because they bought these products wholesale a long time ago and nothing has changed since then. We have talked to retailers and the private sector federation has also been doing its own sensitization campaign. Anyone caught doing that will be punished. The Ministry of Local Government the districts and other local authorities are helping us to enforce this. We urge people to report any shopkeepers who hike prices up so that they may be punished as the law requires. Second, there are rumours that markets will close too, which is not true. Sanitation products had in the last few weeks been more expensive, but we spoke to two manufacturers, Sulfo and Agrofi, to supply new sanitizers and at regular prices. Incidentally, Ruavu Market was closed on Sunday morning and vendors were prevented from entering, apparently because there were no hand sanitizers available for use at the market's gates. Following delays, district authorities ensured that they were provided and the market was reopened, but not before vendors had complained bitterly that they were losing money and unable to sell. People going to markets, restaurants and bars have been urged to maintain distance between themselves and others and also wash their hands regularly.